Hi, good morning, and welcome to my channel, Growing Roots. If you are new to this channel, I am so glad that you're here. My name is Mary Ann, and my husband Jason and I, we, over the past couple of years, have started to live a more self-sustainable life. It's a slow process of everything that we are wanting to do anyways. A year ago, Jason and I felt led to list our house and um, the Lord opened that door of opportunity for our house to sell and um, we moved into a fifth wheel camper and the Lord opened up the door for us to stay in a campground while we were waiting to hear from the Lord as to what the next step was for us, we just continued there in the campground where we were at and we just um, turned our waiting into a classroom and um, planted vegetables and pots and then swimming pools and just did what all that we could do. Um, I love coming to this place. It's so peaceful. I wanted to bring you guys here today to see. So Anyways, while we were waiting for um, the Lord to speak to us as to what we should do next, because we knew that whenever we got the camper, that we weren't going to stay there forever. And um, we kept looking for property and um, we could never find property. And so... We could never find anything and that ended up being because we weren't supposed to stay there and um the door opened for us to take our next stepping stone to north carolina as well the lord's a couple of months after um moving into the camper um, the lord began to deal with us about over in this area um over Tennessee and um, South Carolina, North Carolina area. And um, so friends of ours just recently moved out here a couple of months ago and um, opened a door of opportunity, our next stepping stone for us to um, come out here and we're looking for property um, where we hear the Lord wants us to go next. And, um, so, man, it's warm here in the sun. But, um, what turned into a nine-hour car ride? It was actually a 27-hour drive for us. Um, we were so exhausted at the end of our move. And, um, I think we were awake for, like, almost two days. We had a good night's sleep. Um, once we settled in about 6 a.m. Sunday morning. So I was reading the other day and um, I was reading Ephesians 3, 16 through 19. As I pray that out of his glorious riches, he may strengthen you with power through his spirit in your inner being so that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith. And I pray that you, being rooted and established in love, may have power together with all the saints to grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ, and to know this love that surpasses knowledge, that you may be filled to the measure of all the fullness of God. And I've been thinking a lot this week about my channel, and I... I want it to be a safe place. I want it to be a place of hope that my friends and even people that I don't know 
who will become my new friends, um, that they can come and that they can get a, a place to grow. That you as a believer would be rooted with deep spiritual roots of the revelation of God's love in Christ. And I think about like that of the roots of a plant and how like they go deep down into the soil and back to Ephesians 3 16 through 19 um, it talks about being rooted and established in love well rooted is a horticultural term we all know that established is an architectural term that's meaning founded so being established in his love is like a building with strong foundations laid on solid rock and both of these metaphors they emphasize depth and not superficiality starting to sprinkle being established in God's love is like a building with strong foundations that is laid on solid rock. And so both of these metaphors, they convey that revelation of the love of Christ is necessary for a deep, solid relationship. So... My goal is for this channel is for you to come here and to find love and not just my love, but the love of God and the love of Christ and to show you how much you're loved and that there is hope because we have a savior so whenever I read that scripture in Ephesians I was like wow because my channel is called growing roots and it's gonna be a channel for growing roots of vegetables and flowers and plants At the same time I want it to also be a channel of growing roots in God. Growing roots in the love of Jesus. Thank you for coming today to my channel. Thank you for watching. I hope everybody has a blessed day today. And I pray that out of his glorious riches, that he may strengthen you with power through his spirit in your inner being so that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith. And I pray that you being rooted and established in love may have power together with all the saints to grasp how wide and long and high and how deep is the love of Christ and to know this love that surpasses knowledge that you may be filled with the measure of all the fullness of God. I hope everyone has a blessed day. See ya.